Hello, piggy people, YouTube people, how are you today? Um, yes, this is my third video today, so um, I will be posting them all hopefully very soon. This one is a box opening I'm so excited about for my piggies again. Um, this is for Piggle and Piglet. I um, redid the piggy room. Well, now it's a room. They weren't in a room before. They were in two different rooms before, kind of. My living room, dining room kind of go together, but there's like a small arch in the middle. So I had some in the living room and some in the dining room. So now they're all in the dining room. Um, and I will show that in an updated video. Um, right now I'm still kind of organizing it. So it looks like a disaster. Um, <laughs> so this is some new liners for the cages for Piggle and Piglet because I had to, I made them new cages, um, CNC cages. So I just want to show you the cute, I'm going to cover up, um, addresses, but it's from Honey Bee Lane and she always puts these cute bee paper on her packaging and stuff as well. Um, she is located in Ontario and makes amazing liners and couches and stuff. So I already have all oh, I don't know two two Midwest liners from her. Um a snuggle sack from her and all kinds of line P line like P P pads and drip pads and stuff from her. I've done the other box openings. Um so videos there on um, my Tam Tam C um, YouTube channel. Um, this here is, I'm going to, probably going to be on a new channel. I'm looking into that. And obviously if you uh, see this on that channel, you have found the new channel. Um, so anyway, box opening. Let's get to this. She, so Honeybee Lanes had brought in new material and with me doing new size cages, I needed new um, liners and I fell in love with this material. So I, um, I'd already had um, an order placed with her. She had posted about some couches that she was had material cut for and hadn't made yet. So I, I claimed that material right away because I love little couches. Um, especially for Ringo, he's going, he, but they all, they use them. So I ordered the little couches and then I added the pee pads to my order, um, when I saw the new material. So this is just my, um, stuff, my receipt. Her prices are amazing and she, she just works hard at it and gets it out pretty quickly. Wait times are great and she packages everything so nicely. So we'll start with this first one here. So for the couches, I had got some pee pads and they were just going to be kind of matching colors for them. And I love, oh, I love her color. She, she does really well. She's amazing with picking the colors that go together. Oh, look at that one. That one's sweet. Very cool. And these match also oh, liners that I already have. So it's great. Oh, green polka dots. I have blue polka dots. So the green polka dot is cool. Oh, I'm so, I love, love. I'm so addicted and I love how soft this is. My piggies are so spoiled. So. This is the first couch. So sweet, so nice. They're gonna love them. Let's see which liner will we put in this one first. Well, we might as well do the dark blue. So I'll be changing out their cage today. So this will go in and then I'll be taking pictures and posting them on different places. Maybe do a slideshow of pictures on this channel 
with all my piggy pictures. That's actually a very cool idea to do. Um, so that was couch number one. This is couch number two. Oh, plaid. I love plaid. Very cool. Again, let's see. We got black, we got polka dots, we got green. Let's go green polka dots. Again, looks so comfy. You know what? I've been thinking, I haven't done it yet, but Lucky is sitting here right in front of me and he's gonna test it out. He's not gonna, he might like this. Let's see, are they big enough for him? He's not too much bigger than the piggies. <laughs> if it was on my lap, I'm sure he would sit on it just fine. Here, climb in. You climb in? Might get him a piggy bed. Come on, climb in. If he climbs into it, I'll uh, move the camera and show you. He's sniffing it. So that's Lucky, my dog, if you haven't been introduced to him yet. We have another dog, he's Gimli, he's wandering, he gets noisy, you might hear him in, actually in other videos. I do know he is barking and whining. So, these are my new liners, and like I said, she packages things so well. She doesn't just throw it in the box, she wraps them in tissue, or if she's got these bags, she puts them in the bags and the liners. I, I save these bags for things um, as well. And depending on maybe if I get a big collection, I may even comment my sister and send them back to her so she can reuse them. I don't know if that's something she would be interested in or not, but right now I save them and I use them for things as well. I don't re-put my liners in them because I have a basket for my clean liners once they're used, um, which I will show you all that. That's all going to be in my piggy. It's all in my piggy room. So once I have my room organized and stuff, I will show you. And But oh my goodness, on piggy wash day, <laughs> outside on my line, I don't know what my neighbors think all this fleece that gets hung up, but it's all so adorable. I love watching it hang. And one day I might just do a video of me hanging up my fleece so you guys can see where I hang it to dry in the summer and on nice days. And then maybe I'll do one on a wintry day on the or late at night when I have to do laundry late at night. Technically you're supposed to do laundry later at night because it's cheaper. But when it comes to my piggies, when I clean, their cages that's when I start their fleece because in the wash because I want it outside to hang if it's a nice day not hanging in my bathroom but when I do have to hang it up at night it hangs in my bathroom so one day I might show you my inside hanging which I need more hanging stuff to hang them because I have such a big collection <laughs> but oh my goodness enough to talk about my collection these are hippos to go with my house hippos i oh and the gray oh i love the gray too so piggle and piglet are getting matching hippo liners for their new cages oh that one's upside down but that's okay we'll turn around the hippos isn't this adorable oh, and it's so soft I love fleece, these fleece. And it's made with U-Haul in the middle, so it's absorbent. It's already pre-washed and wicked, so I don't even have to worry about that. I can right away go and clean their cages and put these in, which I am going to do. And I will take pictures and I will post the pictures as well. So anyway, I hope you guys have an amazing day. Lucky disappeared, so he did not sit in a couch to show but one day I might get him to sit in the couch and then I'll know if I am going to order him a couch one day I did order other on another video um which I may upload my older videos to this new channel as well they are on my other channel but I might put them all eventually on on just this channel as well 
Um, but I did order pee pads from her um, for his indoor. He's a little guy, he doesn't like outside, especially in the winter. Um, so he has a little grassy area in the house that's the fake grass, but I use the pee pads underneath it on top of a tray. So that way it's all contained into one area. Um, but I ordered the couple of pee pads from um, Honey Bee Lanes as well in a previous order and they work amazing um, for him. Um, cleaning them is a little different than just cleaning out the piggies, but if anyone is interested in that, I can do a video on that, um, as well. So her liners, in my opinion, are just not just for piggies, rats, and hamsters, and I'm using them for my dogs too. So anyway, back, this is another amazing 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 amount of stuff from her and i love it thank you so much honey bee lanes i'll put the website in the description so that way people can go look at her wonderful stuff all right we'll talk to you soon bye